what was the feeling when Kyrie comes into the building and sits courtside, walks with you guys into the locker room, but obviously can't take two steps onto the floor and play? It's ridiculous. Like, I don't understand it at all. I mean, can't, as it, every, it's a few people in our arena that's unvaxxed, right? Like, they lifted all of that in our arena, right? So what's the, I don't get it. It's a second mandate that says he can come in, but can't play. I just, yeah, I don't get it. It just feels like at this point now, somebody's trying to make a statement or a point um, to flex their authority. Um, but, you know, everybody out here looking for attention, and that's when I feel like the the mayor wants right now some attention, you know. Um, but he'll figure it out soon. He better. Um, but it just didn't make any sense. Like, there's unvaxxed people in this building already. We got a guy who uh, can come into the building. I guess, are they fearing our safety? With Like, I don't get it. So, yeah, we're all confused. Pretty much everybody in the world is confused at this point. Early on in the season, you know, people didn't understand what was going on. But now it just looks stupid. So, hopefully, Eric, you, you got to figure this out. What is it like playing and looking over and seeing him right there? Yeah, I was at the free throw line, I think, when he walked in. And me and Drum looked at each other and was like, yo, this is unreal. Like, I've never seen nothing like this before. And uh, we just smiled. And, I mean, been like we, we, we can say that about a lot of situations over these last two or three years where things just didn't make any sense, you know, especially with COVID being involved. So, um, Hopefully it gets figured out. Like I said, Eric, you got to, I mean, you got to figure something out, man, because, you know, it's looking crazy, especially on national TV, and he can come to the game but not play. Like, come on, man. Hey, yo, Eric, 